Controversial Milwaukee County Sheriff David Clark, an outspoken advocate for President Trump during the campaign. We've learned plagiarized sections of his 2013 master's thesis on U.S. security. Now, just this week, you'll recall, Clark announced he will be joining Trump's administration as an assistant secretary in the Department of Homeland Security, although the department has not confirmed this. CNN's K-File found the evidence of this plagiarism, and K-File's Andrew Kaczynski is joining us now on the phone. Andrew, what did you find? Hey, so we found that uh, David Clark plagiarized 47 times in a 2013 master's thesis that he wrote for the Naval Postgraduate School uh, in Monterey, California. Now, in many of the instances, Clark actually credits uh, some of the work he took with a footnote, similar to uh, a lot of the reporting we did on Monica Crawley copying in her 2000 PhD uh, dissertation. But then he basically proceeds to take these sections wholesale without quotation marks. We're looking at the web right now. This is on CNN.com. Folks can log on. They can go through this interactive site in which we've actually, you've pulled the quotes from the thesis and you've paired them up where from their original source and it's all highlighted. And, and what we're looking at is uh, these sections of plagiarism, many coming from the ACL, from several ACLU reports. You've mentioned that some of the, the quotes were lifted from the 9-11 Commission report, a 2011 article in the Homeland Security Affairs Journal, the Pew Research Center, the list goes on mm -hmm. and on. You, you report 47 times. Is the sheriff responding to this? Uh, so very interestingly, we actually reached out to the sheriff on Friday um, over email. Uh, we gave him a Monday deadline so he could you know, take his time and go through this because it, you know, it is a large number of instances. Uh, and he never got back to us with our request for comment. And then, you know, I'm checking my phone and looking at my Twitter uh, today, and then I see that he's basically just started tweeting about our story. Um, he sent a tweet calling me a hack, basically saying we were about to accuse him of plagiarism. Uh, so that sort of moved up the timeline of the story uh, to today. How, how did you find out that these were plagiarized passages? Well, we actually, uh, so Clark wrote basically this, uh, I guess, biography called Top Under Fire uh, this year. And we first started looking through that, seeing if we drive that. Um, and when we were sort of Googling sections in that book, it came up as this PH, or I'm sorry, this master's uh, thesis for the Naval Postgraduate School. And I had didn't know that he had written the thesis. You know, it's not on his Wikipedia page. Uh, it's just it's just not something that I guess many people knew about him. Uh, and that's when we decided to start checking the thesis. And basically, what we found time and again was that he was, you know, copying uh, paragraph or, or, or sentence after sentence after sentence, uh, word for word from you know sources like the ACLU. Uh, he was citing them. Uh, which is, again, something that Monica Crawley did. But this is something where school guidelines basically specifically say, like, if you are taking sections wholesale from, uh, you know, from any source, you need to put that in quotation marks and note it, uh, which is not something that Clark did. 